Hello everyone, welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. My name is Marina and today I'm going to be solving a problem for your PE transportation exam. The problem states like this. A two-highway intersection with no traffic control occurs between State Route A and State Route B. State Route A, west to east, has a design speed of 55 miles per hour and an approach grade of minus 4%. State Route B, south to north, has a design speed of 70 miles per hour and an approach grade of plus 5%. The area in acres of the approach site triangle at the intersection of State Route A and State Route B is most nearly. Okay, so we are looking uh, into a problem that talks about an intersection with no control. So let's uh, write this down. This is an intersection with no control. Okay, and we have here... Uh, Let's make a sketch. This is our, let's say, state route A, and this is our state route B. State route B has an upgrade uh, from uh, south to north plus 5%, and state route A, west to east, minus 4%. Okay. Uh, so to solve this problem, we're going to be uh, consulting our Ashto Green Book and we're going to be looking on page, so Ashto Green Book, page 9-41 and we're going to look at table 9-4. I already put this table here for you. So this table gives us the length of the side triangle leg for case uh, A uh, with no traffic control. So um, we have that for our state route A. This is uh, operated at 55 miles per hour. So if we look at the table, we're going to find that our length for A is going to be, so let's look, 55, uh, we got 285 feet. And for our state route B, we have 70 miles per hour. And we're going to see that our length for B for 70 miles is 405 feet. Um, now we need to use some adjustment factors based on approach grades. And for that, we're going to look in another table. So this table uh, 9-5 comes from page uh, 9-42 in our Ashto Green Book and we're gonna see that for our uh, so for our state route A we need to use the adjustment factor to correct the length so we got that the length for state route A at 55 miles per hour is equal to 285 but we need to multiply this by the adjustment factor for the intersection uh, side distance based on approach grade. So we have that for our state route uh, A, our, um, our approach grade is minus 4% at 55 miles per hour. So let's look, minus 4 and 55, we got 1.1 so we need to multiply this by 1.1 and we're going to get that our uh, length a uh, is 313.5 feet now we're going to do the same thing for state route b and we got that our uh, length for state route b is uh, 405 and from the table, we're going to look that state route B has plus 5% grade at 70 miles per hour. So let's look that value here, 5 and 70, 0 0.9. So we need to uh, multiply our 405 by 0 0.9. And we're going to get that our uh, length for B is equal 364. Point five feet. So basically, 
we have that our triangle is, so let's make a sketch here for a second. We have, let's say this is our intersection. Um, and then we have that this is, this side length is 364.5. And this is our, so this is LB and this is our LA, which is 313.5. With that, we can uh, build our side triangle here, and we can estimate the area. So our area is going to be 313.5 times 364.5 divided by 2. And we're going to see that our triangle area is going to be uh, 57,135.37 uh, square feet. So we need to um, find the area in acres. So we need to make a conversion here. So let's divide this value by 43,560. This is square feet um, per acre. So we're going to see that our area will be 1.3 acres. So this gives us the correct answer as option B. This concludes this exercise. I hope you learned a lot and I see you next time.